A federal jury has convicted prominent Hong Kong businessman Dr. Chi Ping Patrick Ho of seven of eight counts. Uh, he was convicted of violating the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act on several counts. He was uh, convicted of conspiracy and he was also convicted of money laundering. The jury didn't spend much time deliberating. It was only a few hours. They barely had time to eat, I'm told, by the foreperson of the jury. Um, they did acquit Dr. Ho on one count of money laundering. Uh, the jury foreperson, uh, Margaret Withers, uh, tells me that that was because of some jurisdictional questions that they had about the evidence that was presented to them. They essentially concluded that a bribe that had been paid to the Chadian president uh, had not been transferred uh, through the United States. So that was one of the questions the jury grappled with during its brief deliberations was uh, why a prominent Hong Kong businessman uh, and former uh, Secretary of Home Affairs uh, in that country was standing trial here. Uh, and uh, the Justice Department says the reason is uh, that a lot of the ac actions in this case, uh, a lot of the meetings, uh, the relevant wire transfers, uh, all occurred in Manhattan. Uh, Dr. Ho had a, uh, was a U.S. resident, uh, expected to pay taxes, um, obviously did not declare these bribes that he paid on his taxes, um, and was a re just a resident of, of Manhattan and, and uh, very uh, frequent, made frequent trips to the United Nations. So in all, uh, Dr. Ho was accused of eight counts. There were five counts of violations of the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act, including one count of conspiring to violate that, uh, and three counts of money laundering, including one count of conspiring to money launder. The jury convicted him of seven of eight counts, uh, acquitted him of one count of money laundering.